Hi, I am Neetu Abad. I'm a behavioral scientist and I work here at CDC on COVID-19 vaccine confidence. We here at CDC really believe in speaking through the arts about public health to increase community confidence in COVID-19 vaccines. We have partnered with CORE, Georgia Department of Public Health, the CDC Museum and others at CDC, as well as Living Walls. The project that we are here producing is called Science of Solidarity. It's a project that we have been doing since 2017. The intention with the work that we do is to create a conversation between the artist, a social issue, and the viewer, and take our public space as a democratic space for conversation and information through art. Specifically, the project that we're doing right now with Science of Solidarity is about creating trust around the vaccine. We want to encourage people here in Georgia to get vaccinated, and one of the ways to do that is through art. My name is Anna Akpeli and I'm a local Atlanta arts curator. Living Walls reached out to me to curate their Signs of Solidarity project. I chose nine local Atlanta artists to create five by five feet banners, kind of helping bring awareness to COVID-19 and ultimately kind of push people to get the vaccine that haven't already been vaccinated. I would say that my family is vaccine hesitant I chose to paint my sister after she took my grandmother to get her second vaccination shot, who I think is of our family, the most vulnerable member. And I wrote, protect your family and get vaxxed, because everyone has a family. If you think of the images thrown our way every day through advertisement or signage, our brains are constantly being influenced by our public space. I mean, the second that you get out of your house, you're practically in a world where there's just so much information. So when you are doing this work and you're trying to create art that sits on the public space, you have to be very intentional because it has a lot of power. I think the power of public art, it lives in the same place that you live and it's democratized in like a lot of ways too. I definitely wanted to have a clear message and design, so that's what I use, vaccinate. Like, I don't think you can get any more immediate and direct than that. The whole point is for people to see these banners and hopefully be kind of inspired by them. So it definitely needed to be somewhere that was visible, got a lot of foot traffic, and within those communities were maybe locations that the demographics that we were trying to reach out to would visit. Being able to communicate with these business owners and like learning about them through this process was eye-opening as well because COVID-19 affected them too. I'm Luis Martinez, we are at My Abuela's Food, and I am the owner and chef. The reason that we enjoy having Signs of Solidarity here is because it really stands for what we believe in. We believe in community. Truly, we hope that when people drive by, they feel connected in some way or capacity. Sometimes you look at something and it makes you feel like you have been seen or that you have been understood, and art really does that for many of us. I feel that if we all show that it's a safe way to move forward and we speak about it in a positive way, people are gonna start believing into it. I personally got the vaccine because my mom has cancer. I wasn't going to be able to see her or check in on her until I had that done. And I would say that loving myself now may mean loving you from a distance. I hope that it inspires people to have the courage to get the vaccine and provides the comfort to be confident in the decision that they make. If one, two, a few, you know, decide to get vaccinated, then that's more lives than, than none in any life that we can save. That's, that's a win for us.